Hey Wompers, in the last tutorial we have applied our materials to the scene and in this one I would like to show you how the global lighting affects our reflections as well as the whole scene. For that let's have a look at the right where we find the lights and environment panel. Here we can make quick changes to backdrop, see our lights, disable the floor grid or activate the depth of field. But what we want to have a look at in this tutorial is the global lighting. For that, simply click on change lighting and it will open up its menu. Here you will see a bunch of pictures that you can choose from. So the global lighting is pretty much a skybox image that is displayed on the surface of our materials if we make them shiny and reflective. But it also changes the overall looks and how our scene is displayed in terms of shadows, light and brightness. And that's why I highly recommend to really play around with the global lighting, have a look at some of these images and how it affects your scene, make some changes to the materials as well, because in the end it will make such a big change to your whole piece and can bring it on a whole different level. I also just quickly want to show you again how our materials affect the reflection. So you can see if we turn up that roughness a little bit it almost becomes a bit blurry and the same with the metalness, it almost gives it a bit of a milky kind of look and the higher we increase our metalness, the more clear the reflection becomes. I also do have a little second example for you guys where I try to create some water with a bottle in it and you can really see how Womp is just super amazing for these liquid um, water kind of like creations and materials. Um, here as well, when we change the global lighting with the images, it makes such a huge difference to the reflections and to the whole scene. So definitely make sure you try around with it and find the best lighting for your scene. And one last really important thing is to play around with the exposure. This completely changes how bright your scene is displayed and how the light shines on it. So yeah, give it a try, just have fun experimenting and I can't wait to see how all of you light your scenes.